All right, what's up, y'all? It's like a fan here. As y'all can see by the title of today's video, we're here to show you how to shoot with 53 point in NBA 2K20. This is my new Pierce Slasher build for any of you guys who don't know when you're new to the channel or you just haven't seen the last few vids. I am out here shooting from the wing with this thing, and as you can see, I'm not exactly the most experienced shooter when it comes to this game. I've been on an inside build for the most part this year, and every single year since 2K17, I've been like some sort of slasher, athletic finisher, whatever it may be. And my game usually pertains to more pick and roll game as an inside big, but as you can see, I have 10 shooting badges on this build with 53 pointer and you can see I mean this build is capable of so many things and I put in my thumbnail yesterday too this build can do everything and I didn't even show you that I could shoot so I knew I had to bring all the jump shot video today as you can see though this build is so capable of everything I'm just showing you a cool little you know collage of some clips right here and right here nice little like jump stop on the on the three-point line to check it out and get the dunk anyway the rest of these clips are all shooting as you can see it's got rim takeover I step back pull the three green it and like I said I got my meter on too so like I said I'm quite a novice when it comes to this stuff but it's still so easy to do this and listen y'all I hate the fact that I can do this honestly if I'm being real with y'all I hate the fact that they let you shoot the like shoot the ball like this with 53 pointer in this game and you know it's like this every single year people find jump shots that are gonna work well with them and it is just what it is. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and show you all the jump shot pretty soon here. I'm just going to show these last few clips. If you all enjoy this video and it helps you out, though, feel free to drop a like, sub if you're new, all that good stuff. You see 21 points in the 3 3 poem. Then I hit this little pick and pop off this one. Boom, green the 3 from the, from the corner on the mid right there. I said green the 3, but anyway, you get the deal. Then this last clip right here, I'm just showing you a little chase down. So anyway, here's the jumper for anybody who's curious. So we got base 38. I'm sure a lot of y'all could already tell that by just watching the clips. And then I got release 45 as the uppers. Now I understand it's not the prettiest jump shot. You can see the, the upper is kind of ugly. I don't know what exactly like made me go with 45. My boy AK was just telling me to go with it. So I just roll with it and, and I like it so far. So I'm not going to go ahead and change anything. I'm going to keep it real with y'all. Like I said, I'm not the most experienced shooter, but I feel like that's what should resonate with a lot of you guys who are trying to learn how to shoot better because I'm right there with you. I'm learning myself and this is what I'm loving right now with 53 pointer and 10 shooting badges. So on top of that, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I'm rocking out with for the badges as far as the shooting goes. So you see, I got the gold catch and shoot, bronze clutch shooter, silver quick draw. I love the silver quick draw. I'm probably not going to change that at all, no matter what. And then gold range extender. I'm going to put it like this. I like doing that impressive stuff. I like doing like those, the, you know, deep range, long threes, stuff like that. And you can still hit them with gold range extender. And that's the thing that kills me the most about this game. Honestly, bro, I got 53 pointer and like 10 shooting badges. I shouldn't be able to get range extender in the first place, but on top of that, I'm just shooting from deep range as well. And then I have bronze flexible on. I'm going to put it like this, honestly. It, I would recommend don't use this because for my experience, I don't even hit whites in the first place. And, you know, I know what this is meant for is to, you know, help you make earlies and lates. And I don't really anticipate to make any of those, nor have I made any of them. But you get the deal. What I, what I put this on for was maybe just for the facade of maybe being able to hit, like, you know, slightly earlies and slightly lates. But... I don't really think that's the case because I don't be hitting whites for nothing, bro. <laughs> I don't be hitting whites at all. A lot of the clips that you saw, like I said, I greened almost all of those. So I would maybe say, put this extra badge into hot zone hunter. My problem is I don't have any hot zones. And the problem for me as a slasher is if I'm playing twos, threes, whatever it may be, it may be hard for me to maintain my hot zones because there might be games where I don't even shoot any threes. So that's why it's just tough for me to like, you know, really lean toward this hot zone hunter. Because like I said, I literally have one hot zone right now and it's the right wing. And you saw in those clips, I was going crazy from that right wing. But it's not even a factor of shooting low percentage. It's literally just the fact that I don't shoot there enough. So I don't know. We'll, we'll see what I end up deciding to do with that extra shooting badge. But I love the clutch shooter. I feel like it actually activates pretty often. I'm not sure what the score is. A lot of y'all in the comments could probably let me know that. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and show the three-point rating. Then I'll go ahead and show you guys the gameplay. So as you can see, I'm rocking out 52 three-pointers, 66 mid. What I'm super excited for, and I know a lot of y'all have heard this like literally six times by now. But for those who don't know, I have one more overall to go than I hit 70 ball control. That's going to unlock pro drill moves and that's going to be so big time for my game here and i get 91 vertical 86 speed 85 strength 78 excel it's going to be a nice nice build so anyway let's get straight to the gameplay all right y'all so i'm not going to stretch this video out to 10 minutes i'm gonna show y'all what you came here for and just leave it at that but i do want to show y'all this cool little the collage right here so this is the gameplay that i'm showing y'all like i said i skipped the intros i skipped all the you know five points that we scored here because it was all just straight pick and roll but right here you see just crazy rebounds like i said this player is capable of doing so much man and i just take it out to the wing boom go back in for the contact dunk so anyway for the most part in the rest of this video is almost all jump shots. So you're going to see a couple threes. I think it's like three of them. And then I made a mid as well. Missed one three-pointer as well. So again, just understand 
obviously I'm not flawless, but right here, super long too. And I will say that range extender comes in clutch in those situations as well. Range extender is a must have badge, no matter where you're shooting from, whether that be the corner. I, I know it doesn't make any sense y'all, but like for real, whether that be the corner, long mid range, long threes, whatever it may be, you need range extender to be able to hit your shots consistently. And like I said, that gold catch and shoot, I know 2K Labs tells y'all not to put that on because quote unquote, they're like, you know, their testings on that and you know their their judgment on the badge says that bronze is even like the only thing you'll even get any any efficiency out of but honestly those are all just tests that you know are ran only 200 shots on and if you ran another 200 shots it'd probably have a different outcome and a different number so just understand just because they say gold doesn't make that much of an impact doesn't mean it's completely true all the time but you see again boom straight catch and shoots it doesn't matter on the wing only two percent can test right there but i have no dead eye no nothing like that so again just keep in mind everything to do with my shooting is really like that bro but anyway, you see i missed the one on the wing right there dope gets the o board now i'm back out boom green this one as well and look at this bro i don't even have a jump shot landing on i feel like low key that's like a kind of another myth that a lot of people be talking about as far as like shooting goes where if you have a jump shot landing on like peekaboo i believe it is that uh you can still like green more quote unquote i don't know it's all a lot of mythic stuff when it comes to that jump shot jump shot stuff but anyway i hope y'all enjoyed the vid as you can see eight for ten in that game three for four crazy o boards in that too like i said y'all this build is capable of doing everything and i i just love it so much so anyway that's all for the vid. I hope y'all enjoyed. If you did, feel free to drop a like, sub if you're new, turn on the noties, all that good stuff. Like I said, check out some other content too. I know my last two videos have been pretty short. Yesterday's vid was like four minutes. This one's probably me around, I think like seven or so. so yeah, seven minutes-ish. But anyway, like I said, check out some other content if you're new to the channel. We got a lot of stuff coming as well with like a mixtape with this build. Uh, dribble tutorial when I, hit the, when I hit the 70 ball control. It's going to be some cool stuff. So anyway. If we could get this one to 500 likes in the first 24 hours, like I was saying, I'd appreciate that. And if you made it to the very end of the video, put 99 in the comments to show your support that you made it all the way through this one. But anyway, on that, hope you all enjoyed. Take it easy, man. Peace.